I think I have a great idea. I think, but if it's such a great idea, I don't know why more channels don't do something like this. I've never seen another channel do this. I was thinking about it and how this is a unique job because this is one of the few jobs where I earn money based on your views, which cost you nothing. There are very few professions where your consumer or your customer doesn't have to pay anything for you to earn money. So when I thought about that, I, I thought maybe there's something to this. There's gotta be a way to use this for a good cause, right? If, if there's a way to create money without costing you anything. So I'll tell you where the money from this video is gonna go in a minute. All the ad revenue from this video is gonna go to a good cause here in the Philippines where I'm currently based. So where does this money come from? It comes from the ad revenue of advertisers, right? And so the advertisers place these ads on my videos. You watch those ads and then YouTube gets paid roughly half of that. I get paid roughly the other half. But I wanna explain why I'm doing this. The reason why I'm doing this, and I think it's such a good idea, is because in a way it feels like the, the ad revenue from this is, it's, it's a magical, it's free money that, that none of us are spending. And I can't think of another way where someone could donate to a good cause without spending any money or really not that much time, just the amount of time that it takes to watch this video. You have actually already contributed to this good cause just by watching this video, which is the point of this and why I think it's going to work. Because I think that if we designate all of the funds, all of the ad revenue from this video to something specific, like a, a good cause here in the Philippines, I think that video will organically get pushed more by YouTube maybe because in order for video to perform well it needs to have a high view duration percentage a high click-through rate a high like to dislike ratio engagement comments shares if we all know that we're we're doing this just watching this video for a good cause maybe it's it's going to be received better than a normal video and the engagement will be better the view duration the like to like dislike ratio maybe it will get shared more so if a video does do well they Based on those analytics, YouTube will then push the video more and it will get circulated more, right? And the best part is, obviously you don't have to spend money, I don't have to spend money, but the advertisers who are spending the money still get what they're paying for. They just wanna put their video in front of people who are going to watch their videos, potential clients and customers which is still happening. The advertisers are still getting what they pay for. Everyone wins. However, we do have to be careful. We can't just, you can't just click replay, replay, replay multiple times because that is artificially inflating the views and then the advertiser is not getting what they pay for. So we can't do that. So as long as we don't do that and we're not artificially inflating views, then everyone gets exactly what they're paying for. As far as where the money goes, I don't, I do not like the idea of, of walking up to someone in a difficult situation in life, sticking a camera in their face and handing them money. I, I don't, it feels like exploitation of someone in a difficult situation. I don't like that. I can find a good organization here in the Philippines and at the very least I can post on Instagram or maybe a YouTube story probably a, a video of some sort updating you showing you where the money's going and how much we have earned but it doesn't seem respectful to just walk up and stick a camera in someone's face and hand them money maybe they're currently in a difficult situation right now and they don't want that broadcasted all over youtube that's why you haven't seen me doing other videos where i'm, I'm giving things out i just i don't like filming people in, in those situations if, if i am going to give someone something then i don't need to broadcast it to try to get views or subscriptions or anything like that but for this one, the purpose of this one, I'm, I am publicly stating that this is what it's for because that's the, <laughs> that's the fuel for the circulation of the video, right? At least that's the idea. It may or may not get much traction or many views, but it, it's not gonna hurt and it's still something, it's still money generated that would have otherwise not existed. So at least, at the very least, from this, someone will get a meal or a pillow to sleep on, uh, maybe a rain jacket. Now I'm not saying that I would never have a video that shows us helping in the community, which, which can spread positivity. I'm not saying that, I'm just saying it has to be done in a respectful way with consent to film. And since we don't have that right now, then a donation to a charity is better because they know what to do with the money. I don't right now. But it doesn't cost you anything, so it's not as if I'm asking for donations. I'm sorry, I've got to put on sunglasses. My eyes are very sensitive. This is where I am in the Philippines right now. What initially sparked this was I, I was in the city and it was raining. It's, it's rainy season here. We have typhoons that come through and I saw people in the rain getting wet, living on the streets and, and sleeping with their head on the concrete. And I thought it might, it would be nice, even just something like a rain jacket, something that would last, right? Obviously food and, and water, but those run out in a day. So I, I thought maybe rain jackets or, or pillows 
would be nice, uh, just so you know you don't you don't see people sleeping with their head on the concrete. Uh, so I, I saw that, and then the next day I was I remember I was eating at a restaurant here in the Philippines, and I had, it was too much. It was too much food. I got takeaway, of course, but I remember thinking I have too much food, and I walked down the street. And that same day, I saw someone eating, eating out of a trash bag that someone had put on the side of the road, literally eating out of the trash. And it just, I, I'm aware I have more than I need. And, and the fact that this channel now has uh, the reach that it does and the amount of subscribers and views that it does, then I just, I don't see any reason to just I don't see any reason to not use that if I can, if, you, if, if, it, if this channel has that reach, you know? How much potentially could something like this earn for them? It depends greatly on two factors. It depends on where the viewers are, where the audience is watching this video, and it also depends on the niche of the video. For instance, if people are watching in the United States, that's gonna pay more than if people are watching the video here in the Philippines. Uh, so that, that is a, a big factor in how much it can earn. So you, you probably want to know real numbers. Everyone asks me all the time how much YouTube can earn. Uh, so I'll give you some real numbers. Again, it, it varies greatly. One video can have $1 per thousand views. Another video can have $30 per thousand views or even more maybe. It depends on the variables I mentioned. It depends on the location. It depends on the age group of the demographic of the viewers because advertisers know that 18 year olds don't have as much disposable income as a 45 year old. So if all of your viewers are teenagers, then your ads aren't gonna pay as much as uh, if you're, all of your viewers are in their 40s and 50s and they have money to actually buy these products. Okay, so how much money can it earn? For something like this, I would say if we got 100,000 views, I think it would probably get between 400 and $500. I'm not saying that's the case with all of my videos on my channel. Again, it depends on the type of video. So one video is going to have a completely different pay rate than a different video. I don't expect this to get a million views, but let's say it did, probably $4,000, $5,000 maybe. So there's no cap on this, which is another reason why I wanna do this. There's no cap on how much it can earn. Realistically, I think at the very least, it'll earn $50 at the very least. The upper end of that is unlimited. This might work well, I don't know. And you never know, you never know when these videos take off. I've got several videos that still rank in my top 10 of views every month, That videos that I made months ago or even a year ago. And so these things can, can gain momentum randomly. And so I thought maybe we just create this video and, and put it out there and who, I have no idea what's gonna happen with it. There's no reason not to do this, right? And see if it works. My channel is gonna remain the same. It's a travel related channel here in the Philippines. This video does have to be at least eight minutes long. Another YouTube fact, if you have a video that's at least eight minutes long, then you can have mid-roll ads. You can, you can have ads in the middle of your video, at the end of your video. So let's see what this does. Let's see if it works. Uh, and then if it takes off, awesome, you know? So let's see, I don't know, let's see. 100% of the ad revenue from this is going to go here in the Philippines to a good cause. Honestly, no pressure on you to share this. That's not what I'm trying to do is put any pressure on you in any way. You've already contributed just by watching this. So that's awesome. That's, I think that's really cool. That's the best part of this. Since I first recorded the other video, I have decided that the ad revenue will specifically go to UNICEF Philippines. As I'm relatively new in the Philippines, I still don't know a lot of the smaller charities. UNICEF is well known globally. They primarily focus on Filipino children, but they also do typhoon relief and various projects, various programs. I'll put the link in the description below if you want to check out UNICEF Philippines but I feel comfortable putting the ad revenue there with UNICEF. Oh, thank you so much for watching and contributing and for all of my other usual subscribers, I will see you in the next one. The next one will be a Filipino video, most likely. Bye! 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 Bye!